runeatdrink.net. We're here in Orlando, Florida at the Track Shack. here with America's running coach and uh, Olympian Jeff Galloway and I want you to know this is me telling you all about the e-coaching and all the tools that he provides to help people run injury free he is someone that I pay to coach me this is not a commercial for him he, he is one of the most amazing people and amazing motivating teachers I have ever met. So Jeff, thank you so much for being with us today. Well, Amy, this is a pleasure for me and I can't think of more things that I like more than run, eat, and drink. <laughs> yes. So we want to talk to you a little bit about the running portion. Um, your run, walk, run method has been around for quite some time. Um, how did you go from your Olympic experience to coaching people through a run walk run method? The year after I was in the Olympics, I had a change in careers and I really had to do some soul searching as to what I really wanted to do. And what kept pinging me in my thoughts was this running thing is so great for people and not just myself but others and I saw the changes in folks as they started running uh, but there really weren't any opportunities back in that day and age to uh, support yourself financially when running uh, but I wanted to and so what I came up with was to start a running store and I opened the very first running store in the U.S., Fidipides, and we're still around. Uh, and that's in Atlanta. It's in Atlanta, but the whole provision was that the, the store could provide the finances so that I could then, as people came in the store, teach them how to run and, and tell them uh, how to avoid injuries and, and what to eat and all this stuff, and I've continued that to this day. Now, you have worked with a lot of people on your run, walk, run method. Uh, can you explain uh, some of the key people that helped you formulate the method? I was asked to teach a course in beginning running uh, out of FSU uh, back in, I guess it was uh, 1974. I opened my store in 73, mm -hmm. 74 I was asked to teach the class, 22 in the class, none of them ran. And they were from different walks of life. It, it was very similar to what our training programs, our gallery training programs are like now. Mm -hmm. But I really learned as much from them as they learned from me and how to set up the run, walk, run and how to listen for huffing and puffing when it was very subtle and then how to keep people motivated when they got down. Every one of those first 22 of my students finished either a 5K or 10K and none of them got injured. And I stayed in touch with them, some of them, for several years. We've just finished an amazing talk with Jeff Galloway, who hosted a running school at the Track Shack. And right around the corner, what do we find? One of our favorite things to eat, tapas. This is Santiago's Bodega. Okay, this is cornmeal crusted soft shell crab. There's a sriracha sauce, there's mango, there's red pepper, and a seaweed salad. It looks so pretty. I don't even want to eat. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Get all of that together. 
all the flavors together. I can't wait. Crab flavor comes through, complemented by the sweetness of the mango, the crunch of the red pepper, and the cornmeal breading. The seaweed salad is a nice salty finish. It's definitely something that you should try. Don't be afraid of the soft shell crab. On tap here, and it is from Terrapin out of Athens, Georgia, it's called the Sound Check Pills. So its body looks light. It is um, a pale yellow color, and I know it's going to be refreshing on this hot day, because what I didn't tell you is, before we saw Jeff's running class, we did our six mile long run, so I deserve a nice refreshing beer. Let's give this a try. It is super light. The finish is a little bit happy, but it doesn't hit you over the head with that happiness like an IPA would. I really like the way it starts, and if you like a bitter finish on a beer and a light, refreshing body, you'll definitely like this Terrapin Sound Check Pills. We started the day with an amazing six mile long run on the beautiful Hilton Bonnet Creek property. Then we saw an amazing running school by my coach, my friend, and my mentor, Jeff Galloway. And we ended the day with awesome food and awesome beverages at Santiago's Bodega, courtesy of some really great recommendations from our waiter, Jake. What can I say? We'll see you next time.